Hello, hello everyone. How are you all doing? It's uh, another somewhat decent Wednesday. Hopefully, you're having a good one today. We're going to be carrying on with uh, Parasite Eve as usual. We're currently on day four of this, um, and I think we're coming to the end of disc two. Well, at least the main campaign on disc two, because uh, so we're up to the um, Statue of Liberty section, which is fairly long and quite involved, but. Uh, that is practically the end game of this, so hopefully we'll be able to finish it off today. If not, we'll make a pretty good chunk of it, um, get a pretty good chunk of it done, and uh, set us up to actually get into proper end game afterwards. Um, but yeah, I think it's gonna take a bit long this one because it's uh, it's a pretty involved little dungeon this one, um, but it's actually pretty good. Hopefully, we'll get some good weapons out of it as well because the uh, the actual true end game is in the Chrysler building. Um, and there's quite a lot to do in there, including getting some kick-ass weaponry and armors and all sorts of other stuff as well. So hopefully we'll find some good stuff there. But yeah, hopefully having a good Wednesday. It's been pretty chill for me. I did uh, send off an email to a repair um, center for my mister, but I haven't heard back from them yet. So I'll give them a couple of days just to see if they actually get back in touch. If not, I'll just find some other way to get it repaired. Because I would like this thing repaired. It's I'm just sitting and looking at it now. It's like a really nice looking box, but it doesn't do anything, sadly. So I've got to get this thing fixed. But uh, once it's fixed, I think it'll be good to go because uh, everything else seems to work on it. <laughs> it's just fucking USB ports. I wish they would actually use something other than micro USB. But yeah, it's uh, not really much else to report. Uh, Got some other stuff going on as well. I think uh, it's coming up to the end of the month, and I said I was going to do a uh, Jong documentation month next month, which is probably going to happen, um, which is why I'm trying to get Parasite Eve done as quickly as possible so I don't actually overrun. Um, but hopefully we'll be able to um, get that started next month and actually get some documentation crammed out because there's quite a lot to re-document. Um, handhelds, PC Engine, Sega Saturn, some arcade stuff as well needs to be done as well. So. We will get that all done next month and we can actually make a good start on the stuff that hasn't been done yet because I've got a lot of stuff in the backlog to deal with. 
So this year I'm going to try and get as much of it as done done as possible, so we can actually move on to other stuff that's actually more interesting um, and more entertaining. So yeah, um, yeah, let's go. I was just thinking there as well before. Fucking, it's nearly the end of January. Where the hell did the month go? <laughs> God, nearly February. God damn. Uh, but time's just flying by. Wait. Wait, what? Wait. Oh, shit. Hold on a minute. Uh, this needs the M3U, doesn't it? <clears throat> now, it's probably because I've used the... Um, a combined playlist in uh, Medifen for multi-disc. If you do it normally, like if you just run it normally, you have to basically close the emulator, reload the emulator with a new ISO, and then carry on. But uh, with the with the combined playlist, you can just use F6 and F8 to actually switch discs. I think they should be fine though, because I think the the save game is for um, this particular playlist. <laughs> It'd be all right though. <clears throat> Sub tips. So we're in account and everyone else. Uh, continue. So it's gonna. There it is. Told you. <laughs> it's gonna bug me about sticking disc two in. Yep. So you need to F eight, and then F six, and then F eight again. <clears throat> Yeah, it's, it's more convenient doing it this way because you can just use the function keys to switch discs while you're playing. You don't have to close the emulator. But uh, yeah, I think the, the memory card, um, the way the emulators write memory cards, it uses the, the file name of the disc that you uh, used originally, which is pretty weird. <laughs> so please, I need to give you a thing. Get it, she signed off already. <laughs> yep, so if you just missed it yesterday, we were in a autopilot helicopter because um, we were the only ones who could actually get close enough to Eve to uh, fire off rockets and whatever um, without being set on fire. However, um, shit's happened, the Statue of Liberty has like fallen over. And now we're in Endgame. <laughs> so here we are. <clears throat> Fortunately though, I think I'm not going to be able to get back to my stuff. Oh, Eve. So it was you. Maya. Huh. That must be the name of my host. Let me guess. Your sister? You have the ability to evolve. Why take the side of a doomed species? Humans aren't doomed if my mitochondria has the ability to evolve. It'll evolve to get rid of you. <laughs> ha! Love the sense of humor of yours, girl. I like how they capitalize some of this to emphasize it. Why is it that humans kill? Guns don't peel, kill people. People kill people. <clears throat> humans kill other creatures and they even kill their own kind. We have our reasons, and you sure are a good enough reason for us to kill. Kah. All organisms have something called a territory. This territory is guarded from natural enemies. Until now, humans had no such natural enemy. That is what has allowed them to prosper to this point. You beings must think of your prosperity as history. But you're wrong! We mitochondria have lived within the human being have allowed you to prosper. What? Ha, we mitochondria have made you create the perfect environment for us. Humans have come to rely on civilization and have lost touch with innate physical abilities. Can't you see that it's the perfect scenario? What? Then you're saying that humans were kept alive for the mitochondria's sake? <laughs> you humans just served as transportation vehicles for us. We're cars now, are we? <laughs> <laughs> We're buses. What do you mean? Vehicles to transport us to the time before the mitochondria would become free again. 
Ah, but you see, the vehicle is no longer needed anymore yet, yeah, just as you're selling an old car. From now on, the mitochondria will become human beings and will rule this earth. Really? <clears throat> and stories like all of the players half the time, but yes. <clears throat> Oh, the last boss already. Shit, I thought we were fucking. <laughs> I thought we had the the whole of the statue. Let me to go up first. Ow, ow, ow! Right. Oh well. Ah, <coughs> uh, get off! 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 Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> so technically we could have finished this yesterday then, but uh, whatever. <laughs> Get away from me. Oh my good god, wait. This. So. Is that a random amount that she does that? I need... Oh my god. Get off! 11 from 11. I'm dead. You know. I need to use... I need paste. Yeah, my parasite energy does recharge fairly quickly. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Not quickly enough though. <laughs> I don't even know. Did I actually pick up enough items? Yeah, I'm gonna die. Okay, fine, fine. How much heal so? Oh, I've got plenty. <laughs> I've got loads. <laughs> um, yeah, it's probably because I didn't have any time to go back to the station to pick up the rocket launcher or whatever. I think the recharge kind of is fast at the beginning and then it stops. Is that confuse? Oh great, confuse. <laughs> uh... Yes it is. again <laughs> uh, my buttons are all over the place fuck <laughs> shit can't do jack shit from here okay Parasite energy is not charging up 
after this point, so not sure what causes it to charge up more. Grab attack is not cool. Yeah, now it's recharging again. Was gonna hit me there, shit. <laughs> get away from me, get away from me, get away from me, get away from me! Oh, shit. Dead. Really hard to avoid that. There's a certain way you have to run around for that, actually. One of them you can run to the left and one to the right of it, but it's not always obvious which one's which. I'm alright though. I'm okay for now. And with this, I wish I actually brought the rocket launcher with me. <laughs> ah, I'm getting shot at. Parasite energy done now. Oh, that's a defense down one. Oh, shit. I've got another revive though. Look, G. Go away. Oh. That grab has so much range though. Oh. Up and down as well. <laughs> yeah, I knew that was gonna happen. <sighs> right. <clears throat> Bender, what's up? Speed run the dialogue. <laughs> and I wish I'd brought the rocket launcher now. <laughs> Fortunately, I don't have any way back. Yeah, I might do the Chrysler building. Um, Depending on how quickly it takes us to actually kill Eve. There's the other option is to watch the film <laughs> after this. <laughs> the shame there's like no way back from here. Exposition. Uh. 
<sighs> Come on. It's a shame you can't skip the dialogue, though. Time to go. Oh, that she's just floating off screen. Time to go, right. Okay, so first things first is use haste. I would use liberate, but uh actually let's do that. That sounds like a pretty pretty funny idea. <laughs> let's use use liberate. Three nineteen. Three of four. Three nineteen. Three nineteen. That's a hell of a lot of damage. Three nineteen. Three nineteen. Three nineteen. Like one thousand nine hundred, two thousand damage already. But I get stunned. Thankfully, I have haste. <laughs> Ah, ah, ah. Oh, fuck off, bot. Hold on a minute. That's what I think of your message. Excuse me. To SDS. Oh, that's If I can last out just a little bit longer, I can use Liberate again. <laughs> so I think I get full charges out of this. Yeah, I've got just enough. It's slowing down. Okay, good. Right. Two is it? Three or two? Three or two? Two seventy-two. 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 I think I'm stunned after this, though. Yeah, I'm stunned. <coughs> Yes, I've still got some parasite energy left going. Uh, just three just to heal up. I think if you circle her, she doesn't actually grab you if you're fast enough. June, hey! Oh, thank you for following. Hey! Shit. She has a lot of health. Hmm. 
Yeah, I've got a auto heal on my armor, which it uses um, a healing item if I uh, get hit by a blow that would otherwise kill me. And I'm carrying a lot of uh, high, um, high amount of uh, health. Oh, she's dead. Nice. There we go. I'll give you points for trying. But enough of this nonsense. Watch and learn what evolution really means. I have the power! Power! <laughs> Johan, what's up? He's getting more and more naked as time goes on. <laughs> Oh boy. Right, okay. Shit. Poisoned as well, though. Gotta watch her movements a little bit, though. That's not good. I have been hit with every single status effect under the sun. <clears throat> uh, She's got like unlimited range as well, apparently. Poisons. Yes, okay, good. I use those because I want to really try and get to full parasite energy, which is going to take some time. <laughs> no idea how you avoid that. damage though. Stunned. Already like double stunned <laughs> because of the, uh, the status effect as well. I, I don't understand. No, no, you can't be our natural enemy. No! <laughs> You're gonna get even more naked after this. <clears throat> get more naked. Become powerful. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> nope. Jeez. 
she melted, dissolved into ooze, and maybe grow nipples. <laughs> there must have been some mitochondria that underwent a different type of evolution. Think about it, Eve. <clears throat> Day six, liberation. Here we go, end game time. Giant massive goop. <laughs> Aya, come on. What? Aya, what's wrong? Shit's happening, that's what's wrong. Ha! <laughs> you are great, Aya. Shows that only my partner can pull it off, eh? Yes, I am relieved that you made it back safely. Why the hell did Eve have to bring all this to the Statue of Liberty? Well, shit happens. There's an ocean and what it symbolizes. The sea is the mother of all creation. This is where she wanted to give birth. If you don't mind, I'd like to have some time to myself. Yeah, no problemo. <laughs> is that a phone by any chance? <laughs> Just a completely random green flashing light here. What is this? Is there anything or nothing? Nothing. Alright, I'll let you off. Hi. Hello? <laughs> Officer. Hi. Everyone else has been guided inside, miss. Alright. Oh, there's a door there. Ah, I'm stuck. No need for this anymore. You take it. Keep this a souvenir, huh? Yes, thank you. What? Aya, Wayne came all the way from the precinct to see you. Yo, Aya. Oh, I'll be outside. The smell of oil makes me, um, rather queasy. I knew it. I knew you could do it. When I heard, when I heard that you blew that thing to bits, I had to come over here. Pussy. <laughs> Everyone's saying that you're the number one cop in New York right now. Of course I am. Hey, what's wrong? You killed that thing. Aren't you happy? Guess you're in shock or something, huh? Yeah, uh, you're probably tired too. Now take the things that are in your way. So you rest them now, you hear? Old equipment. I never actually looked at what was in the... Uh... Oh, that was the, the handgun that was... Kind of whatever, wasn't it? <laughs> uh, move. Cute. Oh, I can't move that. What? So I've got to keep Midas' gun at all times. That's kind of shit. Um. Yeah, I can't move his gun out of my inventory at all. Alright, so let's take a look. Yeah, so the rocket launcher does the most damage, followed by the M8000, which is a pretty decent gun. Um, it's just the Rangers, kind of hot garbage. Um, hold items. What do you got for me, eh? Got a lot of junk here. Junk here. That's <laughs> fucking ass loads of tools. Look at all of those stat items as well. <laughs> so I got a. We can probably put the clamp key away. Dog, are you okay? Dog, what the hell are you doing? Oh. Don't fall for coughing up that stuff. Dogs. Right. So. 
sort by medicines. Thankfully, I didn't have to use any of those revives. So I can actually store one of them. <laughs> Come in handy later. Sort by medicine. Right? No meds. Three, 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 four. What the hell are these charms for, anyway? There's a souvenir for Bone Evil Whale. Engrave your name on any weapon. Choose a weapon and armor. <laughs> Fine. Enter name. Um. Hmm. <laughs> oh, we can fit it. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Great being on this cruiser. Gotta tell my mum about this. Right? Congratulations for you. The phone here, though. Right. <laughs> Indeed it is. Indeed it is. Right. <sighs> So, the problem with him being here is that he can't do any mods. So I guess we probably have to uh, go all the way back to the station in order to mods. Officer, well done. I've received some supplies from Admiral Williams. Please make use of whatever items you need. Ooh! Uh... <laughs> I'll take the four. I'll take the ammo actually. Alright, okay. Well, how much ammo are you giving me? Jesus. <laughs> the equipment! <laughs> oh god, I'm just reloading Bat Jong, okay? <laughs> oh dear god. Um, Jim, you can't rename his gun though. The fucking useless. Actually, yeah, it's still fucking useless. <laughs> Alright. So I guess we don't need to be here. <clears throat> we'll probably have to be outside then. How the heck did uh, he get on the cruiser anyway? <laughs> Some Christmas, huh? Tell me about it. <coughs> this the Admiral? Nope, it's something else entirely. <laughs> Sorry we're late. That no, was Admiral Williams. We could not approach the creature without absolute confirmation of its death. Your help was greatly appreciated. Please rest inside. As citizens of the United States? Exclamation mark. Huh? What's going on? What? What is it? You're scaring me. That huge creature that the mitochondria was creating was...
It couldn't have been the uterus for the ultimate being. No! Big jello monster. Man, you're ugly. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> what the hell is that? You've got to be kidding. That is the ultimate being. We didn't make it in time. What are these explosions? The mitochondrial energy must be out of control. To the point where it's causing these explosions. We will escape by helicopter. Please follow me. Guess all we can do now is... Well, guess all we can do for now is run! Like chickens. Aya, come on. Aya, what's wrong? I have to take care of this. Aya, no. What are you gonna do? Don't worry about me. It'll be back. Please hurry. Shut up, man. Aya, please take care. <laughs> yeah, give me a... Give me a thing. Daniel, this is different. It's not the voodoo stuff. Hurry, please. You two should go now. Uh, you're coming back no matter what, you hear? Jello monster. <laughs> what exactly are you going to do, Aya? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? This thing is disgusting. <laughs> it's you and me. Who's going to want to make it through? That's the question. Alright, let's start with Liberate. Seventy four. Okay. Just, interestingly enough, I'm not hitting for like a huge amount now. Five, six, seven. It's done. What the fuck? <laughs> Did I kill it already? Oh no, transform. It, is it growing? What's happening? <laughs> Knights of the Round on Wish.com. Yeah, I gotta hold it off a little bit while I recharge. I can actually hit the uh ow ow ow. Can how much damage is that doing? Nothing. Do I wanna go for the scorpion taily thing? I don't know. Oh, it's just gonna hit the boss as normal then. <coughs> 297 77. Okay. Oh, no, I'm stunned again. <laughs> We're gonna get hit with the. Oh, never mind, it's split. What? 
the shit, it's got lasers! My god. Wow. Oh man, it's hitting pretty hard as well. Hold on a minute. And I need to haste up. Took me laser, 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 laser. <sighs> okay. There's oh, I uh, stuck in the reload animation. Run, 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 run. That doesn't seem that bad, actually. Oh god. <laughs> Shit! Oof. Because it does a charge attack like that, and then after a while it starts doing lasers. Haste. Is it going to evolve again, though? What the shit? Suddenly Dragon Ball Z? <laughs> this... this is the mature being? Yes, it is. I... Fortunately, we have a small problem here. Ow. Didn't survive long enough to actually get liberated off. It's that. Fuck shit 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 can attack it now though But I don't have much healing items left Can't even see what damage is 282 okay 282 Done the. Yep. <sighs> you have got no healing items left. <laughs> uh, not confused. Okay, fine. Can you heal a little bit. Dead. 
Fuck off! <sighs> Revive? Okay. Stay alive, stay alive, stay alive. Okay. It confuses off now. Oh my god, come on. Damn it. <clears throat> hmm. Ah, oh, shit. Grrr. I have an idea. <laughs> Come here. Where is it? Right. Uh, items. I think I'm gonna need a lot of this. Thought I would have been able to go back to the uh, the station, but it seems like that's not gonna happen. So. Let's just overload on healing items. Because this is going to be a pretty rough section, I think. The good thing I saved all of this. Sort my bags out first. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Look at how much shit I've got in here. Plus so I've got the rocket launcher, so... Um, I think I've got enough rockets as well. I have, what, 19 rockets? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That's why I saved as much stuff as I could, just in case. I didn't want to touch the rocket launcher, but... Uh, looks like we're going to have to use it now. Um, I think you get weapons that are equivalent in power to the rocket launcher in the Chrysler building anyway. Um, I think we should be alright for now. <clears throat> Wasn't expecting this bit to take so long, <laughs> but it's fine. Shut up. <laughs> it's 
time for goop. <clears throat> Just GTFO, you idiots. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Just go already. Oh, Goop Baby shows up. The Jelly Baby, isn't it? <laughs> That's basically what it is. Dude, you are ugly. You dropped on your head as a child. How much damage does it take initially then? I don't want to use any of my parasite energy straight away. That's not that bad actually. Outside of its range there. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, so it does this ripple attack. You can actually be out of its range, so you don't actually have to worry about it. There we go. Oh no, fuck. Just fucking blasted me out of the way. How much health does it have? There's three of those, and I think it does the, the nuke attack in a second. Four of those. Nuke. Ripple. <clears throat> yeah, so the first phase isn't that bad, actually. I'm going to start the second phase with Liberate, and then charge up for another one. Evening. How you doing? Get your butt down here. One. Two. The 297 is good actually. 4, 5, 277, 6. I think it's about 7 attacks. 7 or 8 usually. 7. But I'm stunned for about 5 seconds right afterwards. I need to kill that thing straight away. Right, so use this. Fuck. This phase isn't too bad actually if you watch the direction of the lasers. Hmm. 
The problem is it's not always immediately apparent which direction the lasers are coming from. Which is the most annoying part of this attack. Okay. Oh, shit. Fucking ran into it. <laughs> I really don't want to use any parasite energy until the next fight though. I think I can probably get away with it here actually. From up here. Okay. Yeah, I had no choice there. Couldn't run away from that one. And it's Marissa except extremely ugly. <laughs> I don't really have any way to run away from that one though. That really sucks. That's like unavoidable that one. Attacks, that was it? Yeah. Okay. ATB to charge. I can't use it like from all the way across the other side of the map. That would actually be quite safe. It's gonna hit me here though. It's gonna be a two hitter, I think. Yep. As expected. Refuse. <laughs> I 
Okay. Is that a G of G's? Shoot it with the rocket launcher, Aya, come on. <laughs> Completely forgot I had that. Oh my. Okay. Still growing, no way. Is it still evolving? Fuck. Uh, let's do this. <laughs> oh, it's invincible to the rocket launcher, okay. Wait. Oh, it's invincible to all attacks, okay. Right, so... I think I know what to do here, though. Right, so... That's exactly what I'm gonna do. I've only got enough power for one, though, I think. Don't know how much that did. No, it's just doing ones. Three... Four... Five... Yeah, it's just doing ones. That's not good. <laughs> Laser evasion! <laughs> I can't attack the options either. Unfortunately, haste doesn't speed up your, uh, your recharge. We're gonna have a barrier though. No, not yet. Uh, that's absorbed, isn't it? Hmm. I mean, for the most part, I could just run around in circles, but this is not really a good use of my time. <laughs> Hold on. Let's try this. No, it didn't work. Oh! No, that did not. Oh wait, it's actually increasing in power? Hold on. No, it's just doing twos now. <laughs> wait, did that work? <laughs> Somehow that worked! <laughs> I know you want to continue living. After all, you were just born, but... I want to live too, like all other human beings. All other hu human beings. <coughs> Damn, there's no end to this. <coughs> if only we could get this to Aya. What is it? What are those? They're bullets with Aya cells in them. So that's what you were trying to give it. Daniel, you fucking idiot. <laughs> but I think it's too late now. There's nothing we can do. Stupid. Give them to me. Human beans! Look at this, like, uh, late 90s. Daniel, what are you doing?
I think he survived. He's just very, very cooked at the moment. Medium to well done. Daniel, this is from Mida? Okay. Cool. And now have recharge. But I need to heal. <laughs> Medium rare. <laughs> and very crippled, yes. 999s. Nine, nine, yeah, let's go. Time to die, sucker. Jello monster. Go back to the sea. Nope, it's dead. <laughs> it's a shame you can't load it into the rocket launcher, though. <laughs> that would have been funny. Oh my god! There's got to be something on this cruiser to get rid of this. Maybe. A large mob. <laughs> oh, we got to go back in here. Engine room. Okay. Wait, can I save it? Yeah, I can save it midway. Communication systems malfunction. That's fine. Get the fuck out of there, Aya. Shit. <laughs> All right, it's an instant death, is it? That sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, good to know. <clears throat> Gotta go through all that again though. <clears throat> Just fine, I think I know what to do anyway, it's not a problem. Looking Resident Evil Tyrant thing going on there. That's fine though. I mean, the the fight's not that difficult anyway now, I think. It's just the case of ensuring that you've got enough um, Liberate to go. <coughs> so I don't want to use it for the first fight. I do want to use it for the second and third fights though. And for the fourth one, I want to swap to Mater's gun so that it actually does damage. <clears throat> Time for Jelly Baby again. Bang. Stuff go boom. Yada yada yada. Jelly baby. Frickin' Daniel. <clears throat> Could've been done with this nonsense if it wasn't for him. Anyway, jelly baby time. Infinite boss content, yeah, pretty much. 
I just think the Chrysler building is worse than this. <laughs> Ugly. At least I know I don't need to use the rocket launcher on anything at the moment. Well, I could probably use it on the third form just to speed it up a bit, but uh, for the most part, I don't need to worry about it here. Uh, it's probably best to keep it for the uh, the true last boss. Right, it's gonna do the pulse, pulse. Okay, cool. Come on, do your pulsey thing. Good. Four. Five. How many of these do I need to do? Six. Just watching out for the fire burst. That's probably the worst one. It does quite a lot of damage that one. Seven. Ugly baby. Come on, do your thing. Good. Eight. I think it's about nine or ten. I mean, I've got so much ammo, it's not really a problem. No <laughs> Knew it was going to do that. <coughs> well. Ah. <coughs> Jelly baby. This one was pretty annoying. Oh, that's annoying. Liberate actually hits randomly. So if there's multiple targets, it actually hits all of them, like, completely randomly, which is extremely annoying. I'm gonna get hit by that, yep. Ugh. Jump again. Right. Seems to sweep like across the screen <clears throat> 
two. Attack, yep. One, two, three, four. And stun. I think there's an item somewhere which actually stops you from getting stunned when you use that. I confuse. Side energy to recharge. That's okay, I'm alright with that. How did I avoid that? Two liberates and a bunch of rocket shots. Well, grenade launcher shots are enough. Interestingly, though, you can use the fourth form to heal because it's quite easy to avoid the lasers. The thing you need to do is switch to Midas gun and use that for a little bit. Switch weapon here. Yeah, it's a very, very ugly Pokemon, isn't it? Your parasite energy's recharge rate resets at the beginning of every new battle, and that includes boss battles. Ultimate form has Gradius options. <laughs> right, can I get the gun please? No, the bullets rather.
up, Shepsky? Indeed he doesn't. Crazy fuck just plummets like several... Several hundred feet. You are so dead, though, Daniel. Dead on impact, right? Yep. Dead on impact. F in chat for Daniel. <laughs> this is from Mida? Yeah. <laughs> he can warp space time while he drives. <laughs> <laughs> right now I know you have to run away from the stupid thing I just don't know in what direction I'm supposed to be running My god, there's got to be something on this cruise to get rid of this. Yeah, just run, Aya. Run, 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 Open door. Engine room. Yep. That's exactly where we're going. Which way is the camera facing this way? Okay. I don't know where I'm going though. That's the biggest problem. <clears throat> Feel like this is a dead end? Yep, this is a very dead end. Shit. So it's to the left, is it? To the left, okay. <clears throat> mm, God, I hate that. <laughs> God, I hate that. Forgot how bad that is. Let me just check the map first before I go outside. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. I know where I'm going. <clears throat> Well, the first few forms are a problem, so that's alright. <clears throat> Aquas, thank you for the raid. <laughs> that perfectly sums up what's happening right now. <laughs> Some Christmas, yeah, absolutely. Let me just speed run this bit because uh, we've seen this like four times now. <clears throat> I 
Just a bit. Now the last boss isn't tough, it's the stupid chase down dead in one touch um, bit that uh, I've forgotten how to do. <coughs> it's fine though, we'll swing sort this out. We're nearly there though, nearly there. I mean, the funny thing is, this boss isn't that difficult if you're patient enough. It's just the uh, the one touch, chase you down, fucking maze in the, the ship nonsense that's a problem. Okay, boss baby time, round four. <laughs> Plenty of time. Now I think once I eventually finish this, I think we'll watch the film. Because uh, I want to save the, the Chrysler building for the next stream. <clears throat> kind of keen to watch the movie. Because I think it's around about two hours long, so... Have a movie night tonight. Right. It's you and me, baby. <laughs> it's you and me. Do your energy pulse thing. You need to be patient because it takes like about... 12 or 13. There's a round. Oh shit, I don't want to do it. Once it's faded out that you can go in. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you know, sniper rifle would be good here because you shoot once and then you can move straight afterwards. The the grenade launchers, it's good, but it roots you into place for all of its rounds. Just pretty dangerous in some boss battles. Come on, pulse. Pulse. Watching out for the, f the fire burst though, whenever it is. I don't think it does the fire burst unless you get really close to it. Lasers. Actually, first time it's opened up with lasers. Attacks the top thing. The main body, come on. God, I hate that.
boss is being extra annoying this time. Whoa! Jumping a bit. Uh, okay, it's fine. I didn't know which direction that laser was, laser was coming from, so. Final Fantasy music. <laughs> Gotta run around and charge first though. He's gonna do the, the quick attack as he usually does. as well though. Confused. Okay. Not to know how I avoided that though. Oh you have to be near him. Okay. <laughs> now I understand. I was gonna get hit by that anyway, so it's fine. Mm, that one, not quite. There's a certain distance you can be for that, actually. Phase three done. Are those really big testicles that are hanging from his back there? <laughs> Two big nuts. Also, is that Rayquaza? Is this a Pokemon? You're going to be hearing from Nintendo's lawyers. Weapon. Oh. Yeah, should be okay after the next heal three. Yeah, the boss fights aren't that bad, actually. I mean, it is made considerably easier if you have Liberate at this point, but... Uh, 
The forms themselves are pretty cool, actually. Time for suicidal skydiving part four. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> Rip. Ripping pancakes. We got bullets. Bullets. Man, they are aggressive, these laser things. Okay. Here we go again. Yells Daniel and runs away. Oh god. Go 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 go. Like how the ultimate being just like opens the door though. Down the stairs. My god, the viewpoint nearly fucking killed me. <laughs> uh, where am I going? 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 This way? Ah, shit, that's the ladder. Which way is it coming from? Oh, there it is. Get moving. My good God.
Hey, we did it! Oh, thank God. <laughs> oh, God, <it's> stressful. <laughs> and everything's gone bang. There goes like several billions worth of boat. <laughs> You're not going to rescue Aya. Oh, Aya's rescued. Okay, good. It's finally over. I don't understand. Why do I have this power? Because Maya is inside of you too, Aya. <coughs> what? That's <laughs> fucking Daniel's unscathed, yeah. <laughs> How is he still alive? <laughs> When your mother and your sister died, they transplanted a part of your sister into you. Into me? Yeah. When you were seven, you probably don't remember any of it, but... You were born with a defect in your right eye, and so Maya's cornea was transplanted into your right eye. Oh, okay. My right eye? Is that why I've got a bong eye? <laughs> and what I saw when I touched Eve was... It said that when you have an extreme experience... What you see then is branded into the cornea, but this hasn't been scientifically proven. That was Maya's last memory? That was the last thing she ever saw? As for the mitochondria that was in Aya's body, I think it underwent a different evolutionary change than Eve. By living symbiotically with Aya's mitochondria, it still possessed Eve's power. From there, it evolved to the point where it could live symbiotically with the human nucleus. Magic girl. Me and Maya are mitochondrial power. Starting with the incident in Japan and now with this, I wonder if this is a message to all mankind. Message? What kind of message? How can I explain? If the Earth is a single human being, we humans that invade the Earth become like viruses out of control. Oh my god. <laughs> is that where the Matrix got it from? We are in essence upsetting the natural balance of the body. This is definitely utter destruction. No, we're, we're not that weak. <clears throat> you see, humans are in essence parasites. You can say that we are the parasites and the world is our host. Look, the sun's coming up. There's a giant pool of goop over there. And lots of, uh, lots of burning boats. Also, shit's happening in the Chrysler building, yada yada yada. <laughs> We're done! We are done! Sort of, at least for this bit anyway. <clears throat> Halle bloody Luya. <sighs> I do need to save it though at the first. Um... Oh, wait a minute. <clears throat> oh, it's Daniel. <gasps> Ben. Come on, Aya. Here, take my hand. Wait. Back to the opera, is it? I'm not too good with these social events. Nah, not me. I love these things. You're a little young for the opera, right? We have to make up for Christmas Eve. This is my first time, so I'm mm, I'm nervous. Oop, completely skipped that by accident. <laughs> Whatever it said. What? No, no, that's not it. Of course not. Because you're going on a date with Aya, is it? 
<clears throat> I like how Aya's the only one that's dressed up and everyone else is wearing the same shit that they're usually wearing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Is it the opera? We're going to have people burning, jumping from the, uh, the balconies again? Hmm, yes, the Daniel and Ben are late, aren't they? Better hurry, it's going to start any minute now. Popcorn? They left you on your Todd. <laughs> That's what they did. <laughs> What's wrong? You seem tense. <laughs> oh, uh, well, yep, here we go. Yeah, just shove him out the way. I'm sitting next to Aya. <laughs> and sorry, we're late. Yeah, this is auto skipping, by the way. <laughs> the kid just shoves Mida out the way. <laughs> He's like, ah, oh, damn it. Rip. Rip your dating chances. They're doing this one again. <laughs> you know, this kind of reminds me of the uh, the play scene at the very beginning of um, Final Fantasy IX, <laughs> where the, uh, the Tantalus are actually um, infiltrating uh, the play to uh, kidnap the princess. What this reminds me of. <laughs> Burn her at the stake. Aya's having like PTSD now at this point. After all of that, yeah. After all of that, they still play with fire. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, we're on uh, technically New Game Plus now. <laughs> that was good though. It was actually pretty good. 
So it's been a while since I've played through Parasite Eve, so it's nice to do it on stream this time. I've always enjoyed playing this game though. Like the like the story and the, the setting and everything, it's a, it's a fun game. Uh, yeah, we are planning, uh, I am planning on doing the uh, the Chrysler building at some point, but uh, I think for now, maybe we should just watch the film. Because I don't really want to play um, too much tonight. Wanna, what I want to do though is I want to get to the save first, like nearest save first, and then uh, maybe see what we can do from there. <laughs> nah, I don't know if it's gonna be Jong. It's gonna be Jong's next. Um, I do have Racing Lagoon though, the translated version. I'm pretty keen to check that out actually. <laughs> I haven't had a chance to properly look at that yet since it's been translated, so. Racing Lagoon could be up next. <clears throat> yeah, I've heard good things about it, so I want to take a look at it. Um, but yeah, we'll be doing that next, I think. There's plenty to do, though. So I do want my Mr. Fix, though, because there's still stuff I want to do with this as well, but uh, unfortunately, got to wait a little bit. Doog. Doog is doing stuff out there. <sighs> well, I should get back in touch. I'll probably have to email some other repair companies just to see um, if any of them will actually fix it. It's not a problem though, I mean. If I have to send it off, I'll send it off, but uh. I'd rather see if I can get it repaired, like, somewhere locally first. <laughs> yeah, that was good though. I enjoyed that. Uh, there is a whole big section after the credits though, so what I want to do is I want to save it first. Uh, I'm not going to take a look in just yet because I want to save that for maybe tomorrow but uh, we are going to play or rather watch the video next the movie because I did manage to track down the uh, the film um, it's in a pretty good quality and uh, actually I haven't seen it before so I'm <laughs> kind of interested to check out some some uh, ancient Japanese horror movie <coughs> This game is good though. Um, at some point we might take a look at uh, Parasite Eve 2 as well. I mean, I've played through Parasite Eve 2 before, but not on stream. Um, I'm still undecided about playing Third Birthday though. <laughs> Third Birthday is a whole different kettle of fish. <clears throat> so the credits will probably take a while though. Anyway. Yet. Really? Huh. <laughs> That's interesting, I didn't see that. Fucking Metal Black S tribute is being cancelled because Arcade Archives already exists. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind. I'd rather play the Arcade, Ar Arcade Archives version anyway, it's better. <sighs> well then, <clears throat> we've gone through quite a few games this month actually, and what have we played so far? We've played uh, Link Between Worlds, um, we've played the two side-scrolling CDI Zeldas, they were pretty fun actually. Um, we've played Zelda's Adventure, which is ultra jank but actually quite fun. <laughs> uh, what else have we played? Parasite Eve as well. Um, Sweet Home. We actually played quite a fair bit this month, actually. Yeah, still plenty to go through, though. Like I've always got stuff on my backlog to, to sit down and play. I need to finish Final Fantasy VII Remake as well. I'm actually up to Chapter 14. Um, but Chapter 14 is like this huge fetch questy type chapter. Like you've got 
bunch of um, sub quests to do before you go to the main story if you want but they're scattered across the entirety of Midgar which is extremely annoying because there's a lot of traveling to do so I'm currently in the process of finishing that off because I really want to clear it before anything else happens it takes up like 95 gigabytes on my Steam Deck as well so I need to clear it so I can make some space for other games I want to play um, yeah Sweet Home is great and um, there's also Abaddon Princess of the Decay as well um, which is a uh, an indie game that's inspired by Sweet Home, it has like the same top-down um, pixel art type, um, you know, um, display and it's like got virtually the same kind of gameplay as well. Um, but it actually looks pretty cool, um, so I might play that at some point as well, it's actually pretty good. <laughs> What's up, Kluvers? You know, yeah? Yeah, same gameplay except it's porn. I mean, the, the, the original game um, is actually censored, but you can actually get a desensor patch for it. So um, you don't have to play the porn bits, you can just play the story if you want to. <coughs> but that's not what we're about, usually. <laughs> Family friendly indeed, yes. <coughs> Yeah, there's loads of games actually. I've put loads of stuff on my PS2's um, hard drive as well. I've got Fiddle Frame 3, I've got s all of the Silent Hills. Um, again, what else have I put on there? I have loads on the PS2 actually. <laughs> I just recently put a load of games on there. Um, uh, let me just check. Yeah, so I've got all the Fatal Frames. I've got clapped, the Clock Tower. Um, that's Clock Tower 3, by the way. So it's really good, that one. Except it goes all Magical Girl at some point, which is pretty funny. Galarian's the sequel. Haunting Ground, Rule of Rose, which is a brilliant game. For all of the Silent Hills, all of the Fatal Frames. On PS1, I've also got a hold of... Um, what is it? Pure Effect 1 and 2, and the first Galarian's as well. <coughs> uh, Racing Lagoon... Uh, I also got Chrono Cross, which I've been playing through every so often as well. <laughs> I remember who somebody asked me in Discord to play Chrono Cross when I finished Chrono Trigger like a while ago, <laughs> off stream. Um, I might play Chrono Cross at some point actually. Yeah, the original Clock Tower is pretty cool. Uh, I've seen the patch for it actually, um, but I would rather play Clock Tower three instead. <laughs> Lots of bonus points. Whoa! -hoo -hoo! 61 point increase. Nice. Uh, I love the PlayStation era. Like, some of the best games ever came out on that. What do you want, dog? What do you want? Let me just rewrite that. Dog, you're annoying me. What do you want? Insert disk one, switch, switch. Okay. So I guess disk one needs to load all the assets first. <laughs> oh, that's that why it's doing that. All right, so let me just have a quick look um, to see what we've got available to us in the EX mode now. Oh, you can't load this. Wait. Oh, it's NG Plus, isn't it? Oh, EX game, there it is. <laughs> Derp. Right, so I need to load that from EX. Okay. Does it ask me for disk 2 this time, though? Yep, nope, nope, yep. Do we need to see the intro again? That's oh, gonna do all this, isn't it? At a time when Nothing has happened.
Do, 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 do. Here we go again. Yeah, I'm just going to speed run this. I don't think the dialogue's going to change at this point, though. I mean, it asks me to actually put a name back in, but yeah, no point in that. I'm listening. You start at level 1 with 61 bonus points and uh, the pistol. Oh, hold on a minute. <laughs> I got the grenade launcher. Um, and I got my uh, vest back as well. Cool. Unfortunately, you don't have a lot of bag space. And you lose the rocket launcher, sadly. The new game plus. Eh. That is a bit of a ball ache. It's a shame we can't save it from here either. That's fine though. What's uh, save again? Is it F5? <laughs> Is it F5, F7? I'm just going to save a state. Um... <clears throat> F5. Right. We'll come back to this eventually, but uh, right now, I think it's time to watch a film. So, yeah, as I said before, we're going to actually. Uh, Watch the, the Parasite Eve movie, because uh, I don't really feel like playing any more of this, like, for now. Um, especially considering New Game Plus, we have to go from the beginning again. Um, but, uh, yeah, let's let's go and do something else for a change, shall we? <laughs> uh, also, I need to disconnect a few things, so just bear